Techno Mums Tech Line with support from the Institution of Engineering and Technology. I've got a call. Hello, you're through to Techno Mums Tech Line. What's your techno question? Hello, can you tell me how electricity gets into my house, please? That's an interesting question because you can't see, smell, and certainly can't touch electricity, but it's always generally there when you switch on a plug. So how does electricity get into all those switches and sockets? Ah, I've got a great idea. I've got hold of a real-life engineer. Can you give us the lowdown on how electricity gets into our homes? The way electricity gets to your home is it's generated at a power station, um, which then transmits the power through the national grid, which then goes to local transformers. The voltage is then stepped down and then goes into your house. Now let's explore that journey in a bit more detail. First off, the power stations. As we just heard, electricity is made at power stations and that's where a source of energy such as coal, gas, water, nuclear, biomass and even wind is used to turn a turbine that generates electricity. But to get from the power station to your home, that electricity has to be sent through a huge network of cables called the National Grid, which helps deliver the electricity to where it's needed. You'll have seen this grid many times. Remember those lines of pylons that you've seen across fields? That's them. Now, as electricity is not very good at travelling long distances, along its way, electrical devices, called transformers, are used to boost the voltage. This makes the electricity more powerful and helps force it to travel further. But, when the grid reaches your neighbourhood, the voltage of the electricity has to be reduced back down, or stepped down, so it's safe enough to send to houses through cables under the ground. So as you can see, a pretty amazing journey and lots of work so you don't have to sit in the dark. Techno Mums Tech Line, with support from the Institution of Engineering and Technology. Find out more at fungislive.com.